Welcome again to Division with Miss Irvin. And in the past videos, you've been hearing me talk a lot about division being the inverse operation of multiplication. And for students, sometimes looking at a division problem and changing it into a multiplica multiplication problem, it's easier for them to, to come up with the answer. So for today's problem, we're going to be looking at 32 divided by 4. And we're going to try to find out what that is and what it will look like when we make an array model. Now the students were making array models when they were learning multiplication. So this is something that they are familiar with. So you take your divisor, that's our number 4, and you're basically making... Um, an array with or rows of 4 until you get to 32. So I have my first row of 4 and then I keep adding to it till I get to 32. So that's 8 and then 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, and 32. So I made it to 32. I have 32 X's and I have four um, in, um, in each column or four in a row. So I want to see how many how many rows did I end up making. Um, and that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. And eight is our quotient. That's how we know what our quotient is. Um, again, with multiplication, you're thinking, or with division, you're thinking about, well, what four times what number would get me 32? And it is eight. We know that with our multiplication facts. So they kind of go together, and that really helps the kids understand it a little more clearly. So that was a good one. Thanks for stopping by.